Hi, I'm Els, sales consultant for Imbrosa. Imbrosa designs, manufactures and sells the most beautiful umbrellas in the world. From our factory here in Belgium, we ship to over 80 countries worldwide. Let me show you our Icarus umbrella, our leaf-shaped umbrella, inspired by nature. Icarus is a very large umbrella, both in width and length. And thanks to the fact that the leaf can move up and down the pole, it can be used as both a shade maker and a windshield. The Icarus is very easy to use, very easy to open and close. Let me, let me show you. You step behind the Icarus, you loosen this button, and you bring the Icarus up to a somewhat middle height position. You close the button, you undo the short drips here, and then the Icarus folds like this. To open it again, other way around, you pull the ribs, bring them down, both sides, and you lock these small ribs. Then you can put the Icarus in any position you like, just like this. The Icarus does not only have a 180 fan system to open and close it, it also has a 360 rotating mechanism. There is an integrated rotating mechanism inside this base with a locking system. If you unlock the system, grab a side of the Icarus, you can push or pull to put the Icarus in any position you want following the position of the sun. If you have chosen the correct position, lock this button again, make sure the Icarus doesn't move. There are three ways of mounting the Icarus. As you see here on a mobile tile base, which is a galvanized steel base with a top plate and filled with tiles. The total weight of the base is about 180 kilo. The mobile base has four swiveling wheels. That means it's easy to move the Icarus around your terrace and each wheel has a brake. Make sure that once you've chosen the right position for your Icarus, you lock the wheels, make sure the Icarus is safe and steady. Second uh, way of mounting the Icarus is by means of bolting it onto a solid floor. The spigot to do that is always included with the Icarus. The third way is by means of an in-ground anchorage. That means digging a hole, pouring concrete and using Ambrosa's in-ground anchorage to fixate the uh, Icarus. Important to know is that with any of these three systems, the 360 rotational mechanism always works. When not used or left unattended, we always recommend to store the Icarus in a safe and good way. Um, to do that, you close the Icarus. You fold it together. Every Icarus comes with a strap, so you put that around the Icarus to close it really tight. You can always use the base as a step. If you can't reach the Icarus, you can use it as a step. You best bring the Icarus down to its lowest position then. Once you have safely strapped the Icarus against the pole, you take the protective cover. Just one tip, there's a little pocket inside this protective cover in which you can uh, put the strap, make sure you don't lose it. The protective cover is not water resistant, but that's intentional. This, the fabric needs air to prevent from molding in very humid circumstances. Each protective cover comes with glass fiber ribs to be able to reach high. Then you step onto the base at any time in, in the process of manipulating the Icarus, you can step on the base and then you put it over the umbrella like this. You then simply reach for the zipper and close the protective cover. Make sure every bit of the umbrella is inside and that's how it's nicely stored for bad weather or winter. 
As you can see, Icarus has its own look, ease of use, and specific design that you won't find anywhere else. It's a very robust and user-friendly umbrella, robust and wind-resistant thanks to the use of the fiberglass ribs, a material that's very flexible and that will move with the wind, and very user-friendly thanks to the grip and the sliding mechanism that allows you to bring the leaf up and down the pole. Functional beauty that makes your customer happy and that allows him to enjoy the shade in style, that is what Umbrosa stands for. If you have any further questions, I'm Els, I'm here for you, and I'm sure that together we can make this a success story.